World Rally Championship represents the pinnacle of rally racing. It was on this in the national stage where Subaru became the first Japanese automaker to accomplish the great feat of winning three successive manufacturer's titles from 1995 to 1997. The car that was responsible for the three-peat was the Subaru Impreza WRC. The Impreza WRC came bathed in the blue livery of the Subaru Works team. It combined a turbocharged boxer engine with an advanced all-wheel drive system. The machine won many rally competitions, including the Rally A Monte Carlo. After the announcement of the new World Rally car regulations in 1997, the Impreza WRC went to battle as a two-door coupe with unique bliss defenders both at front and rear. Its refreshed appearance strongly resembled the original Impreza 22B STI. From behind the wheel of the new look Impreza WRC, driver Colin McRae claimed three victories for the Subaru Rally team in 1998. Alright, so boom. My name is Kip, and I'm back with another video of Gran Turismo 7. We just got our new update, and one of the things that immediately caught my attention was the return of this legend right here, the Impreza Rally Car 1998. Rally legend. I mean, there's not too much to say about it besides what I just read for y'all. <laughs> but man, as a fan of the Subaru brand myself, this, I mean, this is the, the pinnacle pretty much. This car and the 22B, you can't mention Subaru without them. They, they put on for Subaru on the global stage as far as brand recognition and accomplishments. And now it's in the game, back once again. So, we're gonna check it out. We're gonna do the damn thing. <laughs> Surprised it doesn't cost more. Man, look how beautiful it is. Yes, I do. Now what we're going to do, we're going to go to the garage and, you know, check it out. But first, I got to dial in because you know how I do. Man, listen to that engine. Adjustments is right, you feel me? Truly a legendary car. Rest in peace to Colin McRae, racing legend. can't see my reflection. I am obviously a vampire. <laughs> Inside. Look at the roof. Look at the roof. Mud flaps. Damn, you can even see in the vents. 
That's kind of crazy. One thing I wish you could do is pop the hood. I wish you could pop the hood, pop the trunk, open the doors. That would be a great feature to add. <laughs> Got the STR plates. Hella. Yeah. It's a hella cool car. All right, let's check out the inside. Turn the lights on. Let's go tonight. See it at night. This is what it looks like. Kind of crazy. That's it, ain't really much else to it. This is, this is it. See the side mirrors. Ain't nothing in the back seat. Yeah, all of this is just cool to look at. You can see every detail. You can see the work they really put into the detail of the car. Really, really dope. Real dope, real dope. Give it another, give it another 360. Turn the lights on. That was the you know, 360 right there. Just a little showcase. I like to look at it as if you, you know, see it on the showroom floor. All right. We done threw a high RPM turbocharger in that thing. And now we ready to race. We will be taking the rally car on the fisherman's ranch so without further ado let's get right into it first what i like to do for these normal races is turn off the the ui so we can see you know, i like to race with no ui when i'm racing offline Heightens the immersion, you know. Second. Uh, that's right. All right, man, let's race. This is our first drive in the Impreza Rally Car 98. So uh, let's get to it, man. I'm excited. Team Subaru, baby.
Get out of my way. In the way, buddy. <laughs> Slipped your boy. Get it right. I love rally racing. I know it ain't like this for real, but it's still fun. I think I prefer that, you know, it's different. I got the feel for it. Oh, damn.
Damn. <laughs> too fast. That's what it is. <laughs> I threw in this supercharger and it made my car way too fast. Not supercharger, but turbocharger. First place, easy money. <laughs> oh man. That was too fun. I enjoyed that. <laughs> I kind of want to go again. See if I could do better, you know? I enjoy rally racing, man. You know, some people criticize it like it's not realistic. It's a video game, bro. And for me, that aspect of motorsports has always been interesting. Off-roading in general, whether it's in dirt, snow, even on tarmac. I appreciate tarmac rallying as well. Damn, it just feels so good to do something different. And it requires a whole different skill set. Because you gotta be on point. You know, me, I'm full sending it. <laughs> I'm happy they brought back this car. <laughs> yeah, I, I got some work I need to do. Yeah, I was, I was getting it. Forgive me if I don't say too much. I just enjoy sitting back and watching replays, admiring the game for how beautiful it is. Plus, it's a good way to kind of study your drive. I feel like what helps me improve as a driver personally is watching the game tape. Not even so much as say, you know, I take it super serious and I want to be the best driver in the world, but it's like, why not?
Look at that. That's cool. Like, rally racing just looks cool. I think even the even the the most entry level rally racer you can think of, I bet they still look cool. You know what? I'm going to go one more again. I'll go again. I got one more in me. See if we could get see if we could get clean this time. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, that wasn't good for you.
We did it. <laughs> Man, that was crazy. Yeah, I definitely uh, had a cleaner time that time around. Still no uh, clean raise bonus though, but that's all good. I had fun. That was wonderful. But yeah, man, uh, I definitely appreciate Polyphony for bringing back a racing legend, a WRC legend in the Subaru Rally car. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and end it here, man. That was showcase for the newly added car with the update, and there are plenty more. I just decided to start with this one because this one surprised me and I was heavily anticipating it when it was announced and I'm glad it's here and I look forward to driving it in even more races 
I'm gonna definitely take it to Lake Louise. But yeah. Breathtaking. Anyway, man, that's it. If you like the video, hit the like button. And if you want to see more, subscribe to my channel and turn the notifications on so you're notified every time I pop up. My name is Kip. I'm signing off. Catch you in the next one. Peace.